Hi, in this course you can learn a few Unity 3D basics which are crucial to virtual reality development. Unity 5.1 has made integration with the Oculus Rift very simple. Therefore this course deals with a rash of useful techniques to help you to get started with virtual reality development. The key technique presented in this course is using the head tracking in various ways. In short, to shoot objects, analyze objects, trigger actions at objects as the player looks at them, as well as retrieving the world point to send a character there. As we deal with these main topics, we will see many useful tricks concerning the workflow in terms of the Unity engine as well as in terms of scripting. This course is aimed towards users who are not completely new to Unity, however everything is explained in the necessary detail. I will sometimes link you to the official Unity resources and tutorials to back up your knowledge about specific topics. In general, this course is perfect for you if you are interested in taking part in the upcoming topic of virtual reality. I myself am a student at the Technical University of Braunschweig in Germany. I'm currently about to finish my master's degree in computer science. I've been working with Unity and the Oculus Rift for the better part of a year now, and I've been teaching in general for approximately three years. I'm also running a YouTube channel that mostly deals with Unity 3D related topics. Due to my interest in the Unity engine and the Oculus Rift in particular, I'm happy to share my knowledge with you in this course. Let's talk about what this course is about in more detail. In the setup lesson, all preliminaries such as where to get Unity and the Oculus runtime are dealt with. We then quickly move on to the first tutorial where we start with one of the most important elements for virtual reality development, which would be using the head tracking information. As a first exercise, we see how to shoot objects in the direction in which the player is looking. This lesson involves everything from retrieving the correct direction, instantiating bullets from a prefab, retrieving mouse input, up to applying force to its rigid body component. Finally, we see how to let bullets emerge from a different position, such as a gun that the player carries around. In the next lesson, we see how to use a character controller for an architectural walkthrough. We also deal with exporting 3D models from the free-to-use SketchUp Make into Unity for proper use with the Oculus Rift. As a second part, we implement a simple teleport system to guide the user to the most interesting sites of a 3D model. In the fourth lesson, we make use of the head tracking again. This time, we detect and select objects with the help of raycasts. We then trigger a function at the object which has been looked at. Getting this right will involve a little more programming than the previous examples. The most important thing to take away from this lesson is how to retrieve information about and trigger actions and objects the player focuses on. In the last lesson you can learn how to control a character with the help of nav meshes. We will be able to set the character's next destination by simply looking at a certain position in the world and pressing space. We observe the world from a bird's perspective. We will combine this with a simple camera movement system so that every position could be reached. Now, I hope that you have fun with this course and I hope that you can learn many new things that help you to implement your virtual reality content.